Russia has announced a major breakthrough in cancer treatment. They have announced an mRNA-based vaccine for the cancer treatment. Let's talk about what are the benefits and what has been the conclusive result of the clinical trial of this particular vaccine. Now, this is a mRNA-based vaccine, uh, very similar to the technology of the COVID vaccine, but with a major difference here. That is, it is going to be tailored according to the patient's need. It is going to be tailored according to a patient's RNA so that a patient's immune system can target and attack cancer cells and that is why this is a game changer is what the experts have been saying. Now when we talk about uh, this particular vaccine it is going to be of course specifically target the colon rectal cancer but at the same time there is going to be research that is being done so that it can be looked into how it can treat brain cancer apart from that uh, can skin cancer as well is going to be targeted. Also, in future, the application of this vaccine could help breast, lung cancer as well as well as the pancreatic cancer. Now, as of now, Russia has announced that in some of the oncology centers, this vaccine is already being rolled out. Apart from that, this is going to be free of cost for the citizens of Russia. Now, there are, of course, uh, the clinical trial results have shown that how it has, in fact, shown a high effectiveness. Uh, at the same time, it has shown 100% efficacy as far as the patients are concerned. And most importantly, this particular vaccine can be used repeatedly. That is the good uh, you know, point that is being raised by the experts here. This is not going to be just look into the chemotherapy, but is going to be looking into the immunotherapy of a patient. That means it is going to be focusing majorly on what the patient needs as far as their cancer is concerned. Now, at the same time, the experts have been saying that this is too early. This is a preliminary uh, pre-trial results that we are seeing that 100% efficacy as well as uh, high effectiveness of this vaccine. So there needs to be more research that needs to be done so that it can uh, do a worldwide rollout. At the same time, uh, when we talk about example of, take example of India, it has not been rolled out here. R right now, Russia has not really approached the DGCA as well. So the DGCA and Health Ministry uh, will in fact be looking into the preclinical trial and then an approval will be given to be rolled out in the country. But this, according to the experts, is going to be a major game changer because this is going to be a personalized, a tailored uh, treatment of each cancer patients and this could help them to find fight uh, the, uh, the cancer cells because uh, this is majorly going to shrink the tumor also going to slow down the growth of the cancer cells and also it can be repeatedly used is the major benefit of this particular vaccine fighting so long and so hard that they don't know what the f they're doing.